So, if I were a wizard, where would I set up shop around here? This is Selkie Shell. She has a cauldron and she's not afraid to use it. So I'd be right to call you a witch, would I? Or is, that, is there yes. a pejorative term these days? Um, witch means wise. Okay. Um, it comes from Old Norse. It has a, a female and a male gender. Witcher is yeah. wise woman. Yeah. Witcher is wise man. And, and, and which are you? <laughs> <laughs> Selkie has agreed to cook up Merlin's shape-shifting spell for me. But first, apparently, the air needs to be cleansed with a smudge stick. These incense burners, packed with herbs, are a must-have for any mystic wanting to remove evil spirits and negativity. I do recommend people make their own smudge sticks now. I would only ever make my own smudge stick. I've shop-bought smudge sticks. They're not for me. It's going to go around. Am I part of the cleansing process? Yeah. Well, I think you. I'll give you a little extra. Oh, so you think I'm particularly <laughs> needing of cleansing? I'll take that as an insult, but never mind. For love, some herbs, and an apple with a walnut inside. The walnut symbolizes fertility. For the shape shifting, simply summon the breath of a fiery dragon, as you do. Sal, Orm, Afli. At this point, Merlin would have added a dash of dragon's blood. But as that's pretty hard to come by these days, luckily there's an alternative. Cinnabar gum resin. This so does actually stain your fingers yeah. red. Um, it comes from a tree. So actually. this is like a vegan version of dragon's blood. <laughs> it is, yeah. yeah. I hope this not have too much an effect on me. Love, marriage and fertility. I've, I'm already kind of taken care of in that <laughs> department. Add oak for strength and a sprinkling of holly for aggression and the spell is almost ready for casting. So Merlin would have had some sort of wand. And, we, and do we sort of wave it around, point it at people? Pointing it at Uther. All right. Or I can point it at you. OK. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is a symbol of fertility. OK. As I say, I'm not sure I need any more of that, but that's... Uh, thank you anyway. Then a thank you to the spirits for their guidance and protection. Velga Lauftgast. Velga Belgast. Velga Urchgast, Velga Brimgast. And the spell is cast. Now, you may have noticed that I have not become the spitting image of George Clooney. Perhaps Merlin didn't design it to work on TV. It was the fifth century, after all. If you were here, of course, you'd now be stunned by my craggy Hollywood star good looks. But before I go, Selkie wants to make sure none of the potion goes to waste. Shall we just give some to the world? Cos I think the world needs it. You ready? Yes. A whole lot of love. There was a seal in there earlier. Do you think that, that might appreciate some love from us? <laughs> 